the way. Go that way. Tell them not to do something. I see the same old bullshit day in and day out. But you gotta stop talking like that. As the boss, I may appear heavy-handed at times. I could just touch them. I'll always do whatever it takes to get through to them. You got played. But I'm open to change, if that's what's best for the shop. I'm a student of life after all. Always learning, but never afraid to throw it down in the old schoolyard. I swear <laughs> to God, like, they always need attention. Why would you want to just fit in? You can spit out. Gwen. Yes, Daniel. How are you? Good morning. Excellent. Welcome. Oh. Yeah, there's no numbers. Yeah, the I was door. looking around. I went to the sound guy's <laughs> office over there. I hope you don't mind. Oh. <laughs> so what I do is I coach people about personal, professional, and relationships. And quite often things weave from one to the other, and I'm happy to bounce in any of those domains, so to speak. I'm more than happy to listen. Um, on that note, I have a tendency to be a little vulgar at times, okay. so if you uh, if you have any concerns about how I so approach that gives I, I me permission myself, to sling it back at yeah, you? Yeah, please do. <laughs> <laughs> we have a, a saying in our family, and it's a horrible expression, okay? And, and it's called balls on a dog. There is no hiding it. What you see is what you get, okay? <laughs> and no matter what that dog tries to do, there they are. <laughs> I don't know if you've ever heard it that way, but... No, okay. but that's a good one. I might okay. steal yeah, that. Well, it's good, yeah, day, that's yeah. right. Um, it's not my intention, it's my obligation as a business owner to make sure that I'm a l role model. So by me losing control, that's me not paying attention to my responsibilities. I think of a few different tools and I've actually pulled them th knowing what you're coming in for. This one is the clear model, so that's just really kind of simple. I learned this when I was working with young offenders. Okay. So C is for kind of calming down. Yeah. It's kind of control the situation. So what kind of things can you do for calming down? What, what uh, works for you? I find breathing okay. usually is a good one. Okay. Um, sometimes just removing myself from the situation Perfect. for a couple minutes. L is about listening. Listening is really hard for lots of people. I'm it's not going to lie. It's really hard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, that's my hard one. I, I have a hard time listening. So if you can identify like just a, an I feel situation. Feeling. Yeah, so I feel frustrated when you <laughs> don't clean yeah. up or I feel um, disregarded when I ask you to do this and you don't. Okay. So it's always a feeling word. So it's not like I feel like punching you in the nose yeah. or grabbing your throat, <laughs> yeah. right? Okay. And then the next thing in the E, exploring alternatives. What can we do to make more money? What can we do to bring in more people? That okay. kind of thing could be a lot of fun too. And then A is agreeing. And then R, resume. Shake hands and we're friends again, yeah. that kind of thing. In theory, it sounds great, but she's not in here in the war zone like I am. So I'm gonna practice, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go about some of her techniques, and if they work, they work, but if they don't, they don't. You're gonna be awesome at this, <laughs> okay. I just so know it. And feel free to call if you I, well, have I any will. You probably have a, you, I'll be calling you at four in the morning. Help me! It's not clear anymore. <laughs> it's not clear <laughs> anymore. Calm down. Calm down. <laughs> but it's not clear. There's a couple things around this place that are just not getting done, and I need people to understand how important these things are to the success of this shop. So, um, I'm going to use. Gwen's clear method of, you know, you get more bees with honey and, and see if I get more progress out of them by being a little nicer to them. And um, I hope it works out in the end. Toby, what you doing? I'm knitting. I think it's great that you're doing that. But maybe work isn't the best place to be knitting. No problem. Okay, cool. Put that away. Okay, thank you for your cooperation. No problem. Thank you so much, okay? Yeah, I don't know what that was or who that was. I mean, I'm glad he didn't rip me a new one, but it was really creepy. He's never that nice, or maybe not never, but never to me. <laughs> Miss Ramona. Hey. Do you have two seconds of your time, please? Yeah. Um, I don't want to make you feel uncomfortable by any means, um, <clears throat> but I think your doggy did a number two in the back. Oh, really? Gross. I know, and the problem is, is that I don't want to not allow him to come, but this isn't the first time. If we can maybe come up with some form of solution where we can work together in solving the problem, that way we're all happy. And okay, thanks. Well, thank you very much. Bye. What's up with him? I don't know. Why is he being so weird? What does he want? I don't know. 
He's not freaking out today. He's very diplomatic and polite. And that is not the usual Daniel that I've worked with for four years. <laughs>